Thought I'd tell you a little bit of a story about Miss Jody, if I can get her co to cooperate with me. This is Jo. Yes, there she is. Oh, there's Princess Leia, too. She's got to get her on things. But this is my Jody. Yes, she's loving having some attention, isn't she? So, Jody, well, and Princess, both of them, huh, Princess? Yes, you too. <laughs> they uh, basically kind of own me. I'm not quite sure why, but they managed to do that. So, Miss Jo, she's a sweetie pie. Most of the time, she's also extremely ornery, which is why I wanted to talk about her today. I can't get her in there very well. I'm not very good at this. But anyway, there we are, both of us, I guess. Jo, look up here. Anyway, we'll let her walk off. But she, uh, <laughs> she's a Toggenberg. Toggenbergs tend to think a little bit more than some of the other goats. They also seem to uh, premeditate and plan what they want to do. So, a little story about Miss Jo. Um, let's see, last winter, we had a real big cold spell, real bad cold spell. It was uh, extremely fast. The, the weather changed overnight very, very dramatically with a lot of wind, and it was cold. So, anyway, um, doing chores was rough. It was rough on the animals, but everybody was doing pretty good. Um, the dog likes to come into the barn, but Jody likes to pick on him. She also likes to go out and eat hay. So she was not allowed to go out and eat hay because the dog had to come into the barn that day because it was way too cold. Anyway, she was mad at me. So she stayed in the back corner, kind of pouting at me. In the back, was just staring at me, but pouting with her ears down and mad. Anyway, I told her, too bad, you're gonna have to stay back there because, you know, dog's gonna stay in. So anyway, she, uh, got, I got all done with chores and was checking everybody out, make sure they were good and happy because it was so terribly cold. And she was standing there in the middle of the pen with her leg held up as if it was broken. I thought, how in the world could she break her leg? There's no place in, in here for her to break a leg. There was just a smooth, flat pen. She didn't even do anything, but she managed to, I guess. So um, because her leg was hurt and obviously broken, I brought her out of the pen. <laughs> she limped the whole way, would put no weight on that foot at all, got to the gate and opened the door and she took off running. She was a little stinker. She had lied to me that whole time. Her foot was not broke. She was mad at me because she didn't get to go out and eat hay. And she took off running and went over and started eating hay because she's a stinker and she premeditated that. So <laughs> thankfully she was fine and I was entertained slightly irritated but mostly entertained <laughs> so goats are always fun